Hello YouTube, Jeremy here, and this is just a quick video breaking from the normal gaming content of my channel just to raise awareness of something horrific that happened nearby. So to get straight to the point, as you can see in the video title, cat killed to protect the health and well-being of others. Uh, what? So to start with, I, I consider cats human beings. That they're not pets, they're members of the family. Um, there's no other way to put it because they really are members of family. They, they're not pets. They're not animals. They they are a part of the family. So, so just to get down to what happened, this this stray cat, which due to whatever circumstance, set of circumstances, got inside a restaurant. So the staff had to take it out to him, as they put it to customers. So rather than phone the RSPCA like you'd normally do, or try to get the cat out, you try and scare the cat out, or throw a coat over it, try and catch it. They opted to, as, and this is how they put it in their statement, humanely euthanize the cat. Uh, what? <laughs> so I'm, I'm still trying to get my head around this. Um, the cat was inconvenienced at the restaurant, so they had to kill it. Now, um, that's, that's, that's really, really horrific, to be honest. Um, now, I'm glad the RSPCA are investigating it because the rumours going round that the cat wasn't just killed, it was beaten to death with a rolling pin. Uh, now, as the article link shows, um, this is still being investigated, but if it turns out to be true, the member of staff that did this should have his license certificates, whatever, taken away. They should never, ever work in a restaurant ever again. Because that is just horrific, and I wouldn't out like to have my food served by someone who did that to a cat. Now, I know the restaurant can't control the actions of its staff, and this is ultra rare, so I'm not dissing the restaurant. This is the staff themselves that have done this. But generally speaking, most established businesses in the UK have pest control procedures, which usually involve calling an external contractor to deal with it, but in this case... The chef or member of staff, whoever it was, decided to take matters in their own hands and just deal with it themselves. Uh, and regardless of what happened, a cat lost its life. An innocent cat who just got inside that restaurant because they smelled that delicious food and they were just hungry. <laughs> Vent. Vent. I, I'm, I'm still livid about this. Um, it's just shared all over my Facebook today. I just want to raise awareness of this. Um, this is linked down below. Do go out there and share this video. And don't forget to give your cat a bit of love tonight and a bit of hugs because you just never know. Because this, this is a stray cat, they're calling it. Now, who's to say two months earlier it got lost and ran away? Or maybe a bonfire night. It could have, could have got lost and decided to just run in a direction for hours and hours and hours and just lost its family. And then suddenly it turns up at this restaurant and then just get killed. Yeah, I do. I just, that that's just crazy. It really is crazy. But anyway, just venting. Um, again, just raising awareness of this. And don't forget to share it. And thank you very much for your ear. Doodles.